What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another Souls Like Guide video. We're playing Hellpoint again. Real quick before we jump into the video, guys, I pray that each and every one of you guys are all having a blessed day. If you guys are new to my channel, welcome. I am God's Chosen One, and for those of you guys that are returning, you guys are amazing as always, man. If you guys like Souls, Souls Like, and RPG content such as builds, guides, and tips and tricks videos, consider subscribing if you guys haven't already because that is the kind of content that I make on this channel. Now, with that out of the way, let's jump up in this video. Uh, on this video, guys, I'm going to show you exactly where and how to get both the model entropy conductor and the model induction conductor. I think that's how they're both pronounced, and that's the name of them. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so real quick before I show you guys that and we get into that, um, I just want to talk about what both of them do, what both conductors do. So... Entropy, as far as I know what Entropy does, it basically, if you hit an opponent or a enemy enough times, uh, it basically freezes them, slows them down. Kind of similar to like what the Archon Slaver does to you at the very beginning of the game. Uh, it's very useful if you're using, say, a slower type weapon because it slows down the enemies especially the enemies that are uh more nimble and more quick it's harder to hit with you know say the column or the infused column or you know the thespian mace uh burden uh what is it deliberate burden stuff like that right so you know using that will freeze them with the weapon and cause them to slow down now if you pair that with the uh, Entropic Railgun, it, it's just nasty. Totally nasty. I've got a, a build similar to that. But that's Entropy. Now let's talk about Induction real quick. Induction, what Induction does is it's kind of like if you guys have played Dark Souls, which I'm sure you guys have, or at least majority of you guys have, uh, Induction is like your Pyromancy in uh, Hellpoint. Basically, it scales off a of foresight, and it causes fire, you know, basically burning effect. Uh, if you hit an opponent enough times or an enemy enough times, they burst into flames, and they slowly take, uh, take damage. Actually, they take a lot of damage, if, especially once you get them past the, the, fire, uh, the first threshold of the bar. So, yeah, guys, that's what both the Entropy conductor and the induction conductor both do uh so yeah I'm, I'm gonna show you guys exactly where to get both blueprints right now we are currently right after the consumer boss fight uh alma, alma mater atrium so we are at union park the first breach we come this way we come out the doorway we come down the pathway and then we make a left into the union park And for the purpose of this video, guys, I have killed all the enemies, or at least majority of the enemies in the area that would get in my way, so I'm not wasting your guys' time or mine. Um, another thing to note, too, guys, is that I could, I could have gotten, you know, been closer to do this video, but I'm doing this, you know, at, at the first breach because certain people may not have you know fought the you know our praying host this boss of this area and you know I don't I don't want to spoil anything I don't want to you know I, I just basically want to show full-on guides so that way nobody gets confused of where I'm at so we come inside here inside the big building I'm around the corner and inside here is where the uh, our praying host this boss fight is okay as you can see, there's the breach. So we make our way up the staircase. Flip around. Flip around one more time. And we come right over here. And this is the model induction melee conductor. All right. And then we come right over here. And here's the model Entropic Melee Conductor. 
All right, I'll go inside the inventory real quick, show you guys what they require in order to make. So the induction melee conductor requires a thousand cesium particles and one material accelerator. And the model entropic melee conductor requires the exact same thing. So yeah, guys, that's how and where to get both the model entropic uh, melee conductor as well as the model induction melee conductor. I hope you guys liked the video. I hope you guys thought it was helpful in some kind of a way. If you did, consider dropping a like down below as well as subscribe for more help point content. And before I end the video, guys, uh, if you guys like this guide, I will put a link down in the description box of all my other help point guides. Click the link. It'll pull you up an entire playlist of about 50 plus different guides. So click the link. Check them out, guys. But anyways, that's it for me. I will catch you guys all on the next video. Peace out, everybody. I dream so much, dream so much, I wish you so much, and do so much, and I regret so much. Yeah.